Zach, my man, what's going on? This is lesson three, I believe. I think. I don't know. Anyways, what we're going to do this time is we're going to learn some simple, like a little simple blues progression. It'll get to, it'll help you out, so it'll get, help you so you'll know your way around the fretboard a little bit, and, um, and kind of know what notes to expect where. So first we'll, we'll tune up, so we'll... That's actually pretty good. Oh, oh, come here, kitty. Say hi to Zach. There you go. Good job. Okay. Anyways, so it, the guitar is pretty much in tune, so that's good. Okay. Then we'll go to a shot of the fretboard, and then we'll see what we'll be playing today. just starts over again so but that's one full riff and if you notice it's the same finger the same fingering as the it's the same fingering that we use so we use these four frets go see so yeah, how each finger gets one fret again And, uh, yeah, so each finger gets one fret again. So we start off on here, then we move one string down. And another string down. And then back up to the first one. And then the second part, we move just from this fret to this fret, so it goes. And then back down. And uh, yeah, that's that's pretty much all there is to it. If you can do your the Do Re Mi scales, then um, this one's a little funner because you can kind of dork around with it. And, make silly little songs like I was thinking of one called the I need a new dog blues and it'd be like mm -hmm. I don't or hold on it'd be like mm -hmm. my dog left me and I ain't got no more dog mm -hmm. <sighs> okay well let's try it again mm -hmm. my dog left me and I ain't got no more dog yeah, my dog left me, and I ain't got no more dog. I need to go to the store uh, and buy myself a new dog. And, and, you know, just have fun with it. That's what it's all about. And hopefully you're a little better than I am. So, 
Anyways, um, yeah, once you can get this down, then there's actu there are actually chords that go along with it. And this is actually a bass line. You can play it on the bass guitar. That's how I learned it. And with my old band, I would play I would play this is the bass line, and then my friend Mike would would do the chords. He'd be going he'd be doing the blues chords that went along with it, so it's like Gotta be hitting a wrong string somewhere. Of course, it'd probably help if I clipped my fingernails. But you can kind of hear how the bass line would support that guitar line. So, uh, and yeah, if once you learn how to do some of these single string things on guitar, bass guitar is actually really easy. And and yeah, you can start rocking, yo. All right. Well, um, just practice and stuff. I'll be up in July for Grandma's birthday. And I've got a guitar up there that I was going to buy some strings for, and I was actually going to bring that one back home, because this guitar sounds like junk. You know, maybe it's just the guy playing it. I don't know. But OK. Well, practice stuff, and we'll see you later. Love you. Bye.